It's pronounced Stan. Good evening, everyone. This is Stan Underger with more Fake the News. We came upon this story after a string of coincidences pointed us in this direction. First, as Venus was transiting the sun a few days ago, I was searching for a way to observe the show. Being a drummer, I happened to own some onyx skins on my drum kit, like you see here. This turned out to be a decent solution, and I observed the transit fairly easily. As stories about the sun began to develop on the internet, I became a more critical observer. Now, looking at the sun through the skins, and I imagine welder's glasses would allow you to see the same, we can clearly see a lens in front of the sun. It looks much like the same as a dime in front of a penny. Unfortunately, I don't have a good camera, but you can clearly see it with the naked eye and see through it. Which brings me to two bad scenarios. One, they, that's right, the them folk, are blocking the sun so we don't receive the sun's natural rays which gives us our vitamin D, weakening our immune systems. And considering how they jack with our food and give us every untested drug they can think of, yeah, nothing surprises me when it comes to the deep state trying to kill off the people. And I mean all the people. Don't let them keep twisting you. Together, strong, divided, weak. It's the oldest game they've got. And this one. The second scenario worries me the most. It's a giant Fresnel lens. Go watch what a Fresnel lens does to an ant pile. Then go do some math. Two plus two equals what? That's right. No alien invasion, just a giant microwave oven for our collective asses. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And by the way, the chemtrailing, that's also real. Killing the vegetation so we ain't got much to eat. Don't forget, watch more Whiskey Hammer.